Well, Christmas special. Mummy opened the roof. Ethan can see. What can you see? Can you see the sky? Yeah. Today we're off to Bru Brugham Hall. It's one of these places with stupid spellings. It is Santa by the fireside slash. It says breakfast. Well, Jen said breakfast with Santa, but I don't. Think we're actually. I don't think we're actually having breakfast with Santa. I think it's breakfast then Santa. And Nathan seems quite excited. I don't think he knows what's going on, but he does seem quite excited. And this is not. Hey, <laughs> this is yeah. not conducive for good vlogging. It is so bouncy in the back of your car, Jen. Hey, is it? It's a hard ride. I don't think it's you, I think it's suspension. It's just hard suspension. Anyway, Nathan, we're going to see Father Christmas, aren't we? Yay! <laughs> Are you excited? Christmas. Yeah! So what are we going to do with Father Christmas? Me breakfast with him. Well, we're going to, yes, we're kind of, maybe, breakfast. Mm. Are you excited? Yeah. Do you like Father Christmas? Yeah. Do you know what Father Christmas is? It's Father Christmas. You're right, he is Father Christmas. Thinking about what's happened to me from July Up till now Don't know where Don't know how We're here Way! Excited? Yeah! Are we gonna get out? Yes! Okie dokie We made it and surprisingly just on time considering that we left a, l a little late and we ended up on some magical mystery tour around I don't know where it looked like the sat-nav really should have taken us on a quite Mommy, a substantial I'm road. Just a second, buddy. Mummy, we'll get you out in a second. It looks like the sat-nav should have taken us on quite a substantial road, but because there was a more direct route, it was like a single-track road. There was a sign saying, single-track road, with passing places. I think there was two passing places the entire way. Jen, I'm surprised, didn't have a nervous breakdown. I nearly had a nervous breakdown. It was just like, uh, can you check the postcode to make sure we're going to the right place, please? And I'm like, yes, I'll check now. Shall I get out now? Yes. Daddy, get out. I'm getting out. <laughs> Daddy, Come on, get then. Ready. Out. We won't know that we're falling in love. to see Father Christmas, haven't we? Did we, did we what did Father... Yes. Nathan, and what did Father Christmas give you? I don't know. You do know! You've just been asking for it for the past ten minutes! <laughs> <laughs> the breakfast was pretty good. It was a buffet, which is a shame. And they made us queue to ask the, like the staff at the front of the queue to tell them what we wanted. And they put it on the plate. I've never been to a buffet where you can't help yourself. But anyway, it was buffet style. Uh, we got there, it was slightly awkward because, well, it took forever to get there, but we got there and it was slightly awkward because it wasn't sort of like individual ch like um, tables. It wasn't individual tables for your breakfast. Um, some had individual tables, but others like us shared a table. And I find that so awkward. I'm not a fan of sharing tables and being forced to have conversations with somebody just for the sake of it. It's not the end of the world for me, but I didn't like the fact that I was caught off guard. I was not expecting it and I was like, okay. We tried having a conversation and it was difficult. I'm assuming the other people also felt a bit caught off guard. Um, I tried using Nathan as kind of an excuse to have a conversation. We were all there with kids for Father Christmas, but anyway, they weren't interested. The breakfast was good. The Santa was okay. The experience was kind of cool. It was in like this really old, Hall, Brugham Hall is like a big manor house type thing. And the Santa was interesting. 
He had a suit that looked like he got it from a pound shop, which was a shame. I thought it was going to be a proper Father Christmassy, a decent suit. For the amount you're paying for breakfast and to see Santa, I really thought the suit might have been a bit more convincing. And it was such a lovely sort of like building and traditional looking hall. I thought a less cheap looking Santa was in order. One more complaint about things though, it was that there was no direction. We didn't know, we weren't working there. We didn't know what was happening when. And you had to keep asking what was happening, when was happening. And it seemed like you were asking questions that the people, the staff that were there weren't really prepared to answer. So all in all, I would say that if the staff were, the staff were lovely, mind you, but if they were a bit more prepared and a bit more sort of like assertive in terms of dealing with their customers, it'd have been a lot easier and a lot less stressful because we've got kids that are hungry, kids that are being potty trained, kids that are excited to see Santa, and we just don't know what's going on because we've been ferried from one place to another. So a bit more direction and a bit more, yeah, I think that would have been better. But overall, Nathan loved himself, which is what really matters. He was so excited. And I don't think he realizes why he was excited, but when he saw Santa, he was a bit overwhelmed, but then he got given a present. And now all he will talk about is that present. He just wants to open his present. The question is, does he get to open it today because he got it from Santa today? Or does he have to wait until Christmas? I don't know. Nathan, what's this? It's a present, I think. It is a present. Nathan got a present from Father Christmas. And look at this. It's got his name on it. Two and a half. Nathan Oxley, two and a half. I Should we the, open it? I wonder what they yeah. put in a bag for two it's and a half year olds. It's, it's really chalk. <laughs> okay. <laughs> There may be some treats in here, but I think it's really tricky because a load of get okay. He's <laughs> excited. He's so excited to open it. Wow, is that your present? Shall we show them what else is in here first? Hang on. Let's see what else is in here. Do you want to show the camera? Nathan's got a chocolate lollipop, perfectly suited for a two and a half year old. Let's open it. You want to show Daddy? We'll put it on the side. Yeah. And maybe we can have it later. Okay. What else is in the bag? The oranges in it. Show the camera. <gasps> Two oranges. oranges. That's a nice present, isn't it? And what else? Uh, no. <laughs> it is boring. Yeah. Quickly, dump the bottle. What's that? Reindeer, reindeer poo. Reindeer poo. Can you show the camera your reindeer poo. Like this. Like this. There you go. Let's open it. We can open that later. We'll put that on the side. And okay. what's this? Oh, an official nice list certificate. Look, Nathan. You are on the nice list for being good, kind, and having nice behaviour. He's going into that present. What's that? It's a present. Oh, that looks like a good present. What is it? What's that? Is it a dinosaur? Dinosaur? Wow! Apparently he just wants the orange. Oranges! <laughs> oranges! Oranges! Let's open them. Do you want to eat one? Yeah. So kiddo gets a toy and all he cares about is the Mommy oranges. Mommy, eat one. Eat an eat one. Oh, what about daddy? Where's daddy's? Daddy can join mummy's. Oh, <laughs> thank you. That was it's, lovely. Let's open them. Okay. okay. Shall we go to the table and eat them? Yeah. Come on then. You take that to the table. Let's go and eat them. I open that one as well. Okay. This one's Aiden's, that one's Mummy's. one's Mummy's, and this one's Aiden's. Oh, lovely. I open this one. He is insanely excited about this orange. I think we've got Christmas cracked. This is all he needs. I think we know what you're getting in your stocking, mister. Mmm. Yeah, I like this one now. <laughs> You eat that you like one first. That orange is your favourite. Ah. Yeah. You've always loved oranges, haven't you? Yeah. He also got this super cute passport for getting in to see Father Christmas to prove who he was. I thought this was a really nice touch. He had to fill in his name and his age and then had a little photo booth picture taken of us. There's Nathan and Mummy having breakfast with Santa. Daddy was there, I promise. Yeah, Daddy just didn't make it in for the photo. Mummy wasn't supposed to be in the photo, but Nathan couldn't stand still long enough for the machine to count down from three to one. I think he had about three or four pictures taken, and every one of them, he was just a blur in the corner. Okay, it is now time to open Nathan's present from Father Christmas. 
He's a little excited. What is it, Nathan? It's a dinosaur. Do you want some help? Yeah. Help Oh, the dinosaur's out. What is it? Dinosaur. Wow. Is he is totally happy at playing with the packaging. The dinosaur is just abandoned. Hello. It's Oh, this is gonna eat your nose. Are you ready? No. Are you ready? It is. It's gonna eat your nose. Are you ready? That's right.